Hey everyone, uh, my name's Chris. I'm here to take you through a little workout. Uh, it's gonna be a weekly workout. We're gonna do one a week throughout January. So the first one start today, and there'll be another one next Saturday and so on. So I um, hope you're all up for it. Um, feeling energized, uh, we'll get a little sweat on. Um, just a little bit of background information about myself. Um, so obviously I'm Chris. I got asked to do the video uh, by a friend, um, somebody you know who holds the charity very close to their heart. Um, they help them through a difficult time. Um, so asked me to help out, do these videos. I said I was more than happy to do so. Um, I will give you a little bit of um, background information in a minute, but like I said, for me personally, so I'm a postman, so that's my job. Um, I'm also a amateur duo athlete. I compete for the Great Britain age group team, which um, amateur level, but um, yeah, so that's enough about me anyway. Anyway, I'll give you a couple of little facts and after the first my notes um, about the hospice. So Western Hospice Care was formed in 1989. Um, it was formed by residents of Western Supermare uh, who recognised the need for care for people with um, either life limiting illnesses or terminal illnesses. Uh, the first day of services were in 1991, um, followed by the opening of an inpatient unit in 1997. In 2002, they moved into Jackson Barstow House in Uphill. Um, and currently, they care for around 2,000 people every year, like I said, with either terminal illnesses or life limiting illnesses. So it's, um, it's a great charity, and it's obviously, um, I know someone indirectly who you know who's involved with it um so if you can donate there is a donate button attached to the video below so please if you can donate like i said it's a great charity anyway so i'll talk you for a little bit about the, uh, the workout we're going to do it's going to be like um just like a, like a kind of joe wick style hit kind of workout um you know i'm not quite as good looking as joe wicks but he was he was too expensive we couldn't afford him so you got me instead so um, basically we're going to just have a little a little warm up so we're just going to jog on the spot 30 seconds um just real light jogging just to get the sort of heart rate up a little bit nothing too intense um i think throughout these these videos we might try and make it a bit more fun maybe if you if you want to dress up or anyone's got any suggestions leave them in the comments box and um, we can try and have a bit of fun with it but um it's just really about just getting moving. Um, you get a little sweat on, you know, and obviously throughout this um, this lockdown period, it's important, I think, to do this. The reason I do it, exercise physically, you know, I like being fit, I need to be fit for the sport I do, but also um, mentally. I do it mentally. Any, any anxiety I've got, stress, it helps me massively. So if we just come down to one knee now, I'm just going to stretch out the hip flexors. So you just want to put one leg forward and just lean over that front leg. Try and keep, make sure your knee doesn't go beyond your foot. And we're just going to do that and then lean back into a hamstring stretch. Uh, and then again, we'll just do that a couple of times. Just open up that hip flexor a little bit. And then just switch sides, same again. We're not going to hold the stretches for too long because um, we want sort of a more dynamic stretch for now. Just, just to warm up and open up that hip flexor and, and hamstring, like I said. Okay, if we come on to our sort of hands and knees, we're just going to sort of rock backwards and forwards just to, just to sort of warm the wrists up a little bit because we will be doing sort of push-ups and burpees. So just do that. And another one you can do is just kind of put your hands together like that. In prior position, just roll them, just warm the wrists up a little bit. Okay, we'll have a little jog on the spot just to get warmed up and then we'll get into it. Okay, so first one we're going to do is we're literally just back to jogging on the spot. That's all they know, so we're just going to do that for 30 minutes. No, I'm kidding. So we're just going to jog on the spot. What we're going to do, we're going to do it for 30 seconds. And then we're going to um, have a 30 second rest, go on to the next exercise. Uh, again, 30 seconds on, 30 seconds off. And we're going to complete, um, I think, about eight exercises in total. And then we will have a little short break and then we'll go do it again. So we'll do two rounds and that will 
complete the workout. Okay, and I'll, I'll talk to you and sort of give you a bit of a demonstration between each one. Okay, so first one, we're gonna go straight into run on the spot and just literally just punch into the sky, okay? Okay, so we're going two, one, okay, go. If you're a beginner, just keep it nice and gentle like this. If you're a little bit fitter, you can kind of, you can do this if you want, get to a bit of a sprint. Just do it at your own pace, it's not a competition. Nearly there, another seven seconds. Okay, three, two, one. Okay, that completes the first one. Okay, so the second exercise we're going to do, we're just gonna do some squats and straight forward. Just try and keep your knees slightly apart, feet say hip width apart, and try and point your feet out slightly outwards. So what you wanna do is as you go down, make sure the knees don't collapse inwards. So you wanna kind of try and stop this happening. So come down and this will just activate your glutes nicely for all you girls out there that want the Kim Kardashian. Uh, all the guys. Okay, so off we go. Just gonna do this for 30 seconds. Like I said, just try and keep, make sure those knees don't collapse in. You don't have to go way down. If you can only go to there, just go to there. And like I said, do it nice and slow and controlled really. You can go a little bit deeper. Do that, try and, try and keep a straight back. Okay. It's good. Okay, well done. Have a 30 second rest. Okay, the next exercise we're going to do is we're going to do push ups. So you can go into a full push up, push -up position like this. Kind of want hands shoulder width apart, or you can go a little bit wider if you want with this. Try and bring your chest to the floor. Um, we're going to do two push ups and then come into mountain climbers like this. We can do three, four of those, and then back to push ups. If you can't do a full push up, go on your knees and literally just come down from your knees and then one, two, three, four. Okay, off we go. Let's go. Like I said, just do it at your own pace. Okay, have a 30 second rest. Next one we're going to do is just lunges. So if you want to step forward, alternate legs. Like I said, you don't want that front knee, you want to try and start the front knee coming over the front foot. So keep your knee and lunge your foot. So we'll do 30 seconds of those and we'll have another 30 second rest. Oh, get out of breath. Okay, I hope you, you should be nicely warmed up by now. Okay, let's go. One, two, three, four. Okay, try and keep straight back again. Good again, like I said, for the quads and your uh, glutes. You do that. Okay, have a 30 second break, get some more if you want. You should be getting nicely warmed up now. Next exercise I was going to do is a plank. So you want to come down to your elbows like this. And just hold this position. It's 30 seconds. If you can't, if you want a little break in between, you can't do it. Just rest on your knees for a second and come back up. Or if you're really struggling, just come onto your knees and just hold your top half up. So just it's your workout. Just do what you can. Don't don't try and overdo it. Okay, you ready? Let's go. You want to try and keep try, try and keep a nice straight line if you can. You know, try not to let your uh, butt go up in the air too much or sink. Try and keep that straight line. Like I said, if you're struggling, come down on your knees or just take a break and come back up. Okay, 
Okay, excellent. Shake it out, have a 30 second rest. Okay, next one we're gonna do, it's a simple, we're just gonna jump like this and back over. Bend knees straight back. You can either jump over something, put something down, like your husband, wife, kids, whatever, or tend to jump maybe like a cute puppy, something, you don't want to squash them. Anything like that. Okay, you ready? Let's go. So get a good bend in your knees. You don't have to jump miles, it's literally if you want to go a bit further, feel free. 10 seconds left. Okay, well done. Okay, another breather. Okay, next what we're going to do, more familiar with this, just sit ups. So just try and keep your feet or hip width apart. Come down, come up, just really engage that core and come up, try and keep your back straight. If you want to put your hands inside your head, go for it, but just don't pull on your neck. Just don't injure your neck. Okay, let's go. Okay, go at your own pace, like I said. Don't go and try and do good, good uh, try and go too fast and burn out. Just keep it your own pace. You should start to feel that burn on those abs. Okay. Let me start to rest. Just put a little burn there. The next one we're gonna do is just a simple burpee. So it's literally just a case of Jump up, soft knees, down, jump back, into the push-up, up, jump back up, and up to finish. And you do that again, 30 seconds. You can skip the push-up if you want, just go straight back into the burpee. So as you come down, just come straight back up, or go onto your knees again for the push-ups, however, however you feel comfortable. Okay, time is a little bit off, bear with me, but we'll just do it as we as good as we can. Okay, let's go. A little couple of minutes breather. I certainly need it. Get yourself a drink of water and then we'll go again for round two. Oh. Like I said, we will be doing these once a week. So, so I'm trying to catch my breath. We will mix up a bit, um, throw in some different exercises, maybe do some. Um, some weeks more core, some weeks more strength, some weeks a bit more cardio, whatever. Um, and like I said, I might add a bit of fun to it, maybe bring some fancy dress into it, something like that, we'll figure it out. But it's all about just, especially like I said, during this lockdown, I think everyone's fed up with it now. Um, I know certainly myself, if I sit around too long indoors, it affects my mental health. I know a lot of people, in the same boat so just getting up just getting this little 20 minute workout that's all you need to do it will just boost your mood um you should feel better about it. so i appreciate all the people that are sort of logged on to watch thank you very much please spread the word like i said there is a donate button attached to the video okay so we're going to go into round two so same again just literally we're just going to jog on the spot again like i said so just jog on the spot Punches to the roof, like that. I so said, if you want to go a bit faster, you can get those knees up. Or just slow it down. Just go your own pace. 15 seconds to go. Okay, 
five, four, three, two, one. Okay, and rest. Okay, next one. Like I said, the simple squat again. So remember, feet hip width apart. I'm trying to let those knees draw in. Uh, so for people aren't familiar with this, this, you will feel this on your glutes. Maybe tomorrow, next day. But it's a great one, great exercise for uh, toning up your back muscles. Okay, four, three, two, one. Okay, bang. So just focus more on your technique. Don't rush it. Try and keep your back straight. That's good. Let's see from the side angle. Try and sit back on your heels a little bit. Hip side. Four, three, two, one. Okay. 30 seconds rest. Next one, we're going to go back into push ups and mountain climbers. So, it's not my normal kind of workout, and it's getting to me a little bit, I must be honest. Okay, so, have a 10 seconds rest. Get a couple of deep breaths in. And get ready to go. Okay, four, three, two, one. So, two push ups, and one, two, three, four. One, two. 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 One, two, three, four. Okay, excellent job. Shift a little bit on your shoulders, like I said. Doing that. Abs. Uh, okay, next one, lunges. Like I said, just step forward, keep, try keeping that, that flat back and try not let your knee go your ankle too far. Okay, five, four, three, two, one. Okay, go. Just alternate it, left and right. So get, get your kids involved if they're not ready. It's a great way for the, them to sort of release a little bit of that energy. I've got a four year old, so I'm gonna get her involved, hopefully next week. Because she seems to have endless amounts. Okay, that's it, another 30 seconds rest. Then we're gonna come into our plank. So, like I said, on your elbows, and then it's flat back. I so said, if you need a break, just come into all fours and then come back into it. Um, this is great for building your core strength. Um, very good exercise for that. Okay, here we go. Halfway there, come on. Okay, five, four, three, two, one. Nice and relax. Okay, two more to go, three more to go, sorry. Okay, so we're gonna come back into a long jump here. Uh, okay, 20 seconds rest, have a little drink. Okay, 10 seconds. I'm trying not to upset the neighbors downstairs, so my jumps are a little bit, they're not really ideal, but still, like I said, just get it done. Okay, let's go. Seconds left. Okay, 
Okay, and rest. Oh, we're nearly there. Like I said, just just doing a bit of exercise during this lockdown period will will help your mental state. Even if it's just getting out for a walk, twenty minute walk, um, doing this, whatever, really. Okay, two more to go. So back into our sit ups. So thirty seconds of this, and then a rest, and the final exercise, and we're done. Okay, let's go. So put your hands both side of your head. You can do that. Three, two, one. And relax. Okay, back into our final exercise. The burpees. Like I said, I don't normally do this type of, type of workout. Normally I'm just running, cycling, so it's all a bit new to me, but apparently everyone hates this. I don't actually mind this one too much. But um, anyway, give it a good go. So last, last exercise. Five, four, three, two, one. Okay. Try and land with soft knees, bent knees. Like I said, if you can't do a full push up, you come down on your knees. Or just skip it straight back up. Three, two, one. Oh, nice job. That's the workout complete. That's week one. Oh, it's actually a bit harder than I imagined it would be. Uh, well done to everyone who completed it. Please, like I said, spread the message. Um, and if you can donate any amount, great. Just please, it's a great charity. Um, I will see you next week, hopefully. Um, I'll open a window next week, I think. Um, yeah, so next week, same time. See you there.